the tackle. Yeah, great effort by Thomas to uh, fight Rivers, fight Wyatt, and pick up the first down. Because he doesn't have the first down when he catches this ball. But look how quick he gets up the field. Lowers his shoulder on Wyatt and then dives out just enough to pick up the first down. Great play by David Thomas. Romach Taylor checks into the backfield now at tailback. Standing alongside Vance Young and the Trojan came flying through. And he's saying that Texas lineman moved. And let's see what uh, David Whitwell says. Offside, USC. The show that swept America off its feet is back. Ten new celebrities taking on the toughest challenge of their lives, including football legend Jerry Rice, broadcaster Kenny Mayne of ESPN. Oscar winner Tatum O'Neill, new steps, new stars, new seasons, and Dancing with the Stars, two hour season premiere live tomorrow at 8 7 on ABC. Ball is on the 47 yard line. And after the offside call, it's first in time. Young looking. They chase him out. And he throws back across the field. Pass is complete to Brian Carter. Carter will be inside the 30, down to the 27 before Pinkerton can bring him down. Brian Cushing was the man pursuing Vince Young, but he big strong guy, and he's so tall, he sees the entire field. Well, one man can't bring him down. Number 10 is Cushing. He chases number 10, Young, but can't get to him. Big play again by Vince Young. The SC 27 Young drops back, takes off, up the middle. He's finally caught at the 15 yard line by Darnell Bing. Bing got him by locking his legs around the ankle. Well, Frosty Rucker, the defensive end on the left side of the Texas offensive line, check him out right here. He's going to come up the field too far. It's a design draw play. Great block by Ramon's Taylor. And then just check this out. If there was ever a hot quarterback, it's Vince Young. Eight for eight throwing. And now four carries for 42 yards. And the ball is at the 15 yard line. First down. A little shovel pass goes to Ramon Taylor. And he's taken down uh, short of the line of scrimmage by Lawan Ramsey. Defensive tackle. You know that type of play I think I'd save it for when the uh, Trojans were getting better pass pressure that time Ramsey was just hanging around the line of scrimmage. He was there for that shovel pass. It'll be second down 11 Pete Carroll is the defensive coordinator for USC. Balls loose. Texas is going to get it back. Wow. Trojans ran right over the top of it. Oscar Lua came in and knocked it loose or banged him enough and he dropped the ball and then the Trojans could not get to it. Uh, it's a real tribute to the Texas offense. You know, this is 33 fumbles on the year but they're so good at recognizing when they do fumble that they recover a lot of them. Check out Vince Young diving in there to save the Longhorn Bacon. Lua was the one who had the best chance at it and just scored it up hundred. So it's third down and 24 now for the Longhorns. USC is leading seven to nothing. And Young's got to be thinking about getting half of it back, putting his team in field goal range. Looking around. Goes down the middle and it is incomplete. There were two Longhorns and four Trojans on that play back there around the eight yard line. Might have been a mistake to try to get it all back. That's his first incompletion of the night, but SC brought pressure with a corner blitz by Justin Wyatt. That may have forced uh, Young to get rid of that sooner than he wanted to. He also had seven DBs in there on that uh, play then. Yeah, that's that uh, speed on the field, and it paid off for the Trojans. Well, they're going to go for a field goal here. It'll be David Pino, a 46 yard try. That's for him uh, pretty good size. 
He's been steady and he's worked on that leg and he's got enough leg on this one and it's good. That is career long 46 yard field goal for David Pino and the Longhorns are on the board. It rained on Monday. Oh, did it rain on Monday? Right on the Rose Parade, Queen Camille Clark, 18-year-old pretty lady from LaSalle High School here in Pasadena. The helicopters were out six times drying the field, but that's still too short of the record from the days of the super teams at Punahou in Hawaii. But it is a Rose Bowl record. It is a Rose Bowl record, yes. It can really rain at Punahou sometimes. On that old play track, you can make a right up your ankles. In come the helicopter. Mm. Oh, we had two of them out. Yeah, two. But the field is very good. It's awesome. Walked on it before the game. Dry, firm. Five eighths of an inch long each blade of grass. How about that? Wouldn't work. No today. <laughs> <laughs> they go 5.58. <laughs> Ball is on the 35 yard line now. Seven to three. Trojans have the lead and the kickoff. In Texas by Greg Johnson down to the six yard line. Darnell Bing has this one. And the big old safety comes on back out to about the 27 yard line. Time for our deep rushing playbook following a fumbled punt. Lendell White is going to go into the end zone behind great down blocking here by Sam Baker Fred Davis and then Fred Matua and Brandon Hancock get out in front and it's a walk in for number 21. Rushing touchdown number 22 on the year and as you said Keith he's been in the end zone a whole lot. Remember now both these teams averaging over 50 points per game. During the regular season but it's seven to three. With uh, 10 minutes to go in the first half here at the Rose Bowl. They win championship with defense. Ball thrown to Smith. Well, that's a heck of a catch by Steve oh. Smith with Michael Huff drilling him in the back. Ball thrown low by Leinert. A perfect strike on the outside corner, and Huff can't believe it. Check out the reaction by Huff. He's all over him. That's really close. I think his left arm was underneath the ball. That's really tough. They, they might have to take a look at this upstairs. Yep. I think so. The replay official is Jim Augustine. Dick Honig is the backup for that. Operation upstairs. Dave Perry, the national coordinator of officials, is up here in the booth with us. And Jim Augustine is having a look. As he comes back for the ball, watch his left arm. He's got, the, he's got it cradled. He's got it cradled, but a lot of that ball is touching the ground, I gotta believe. But from the pictures we've shown you, and this is what they're looking at upstairs, I'm not sure they'll overturn this one. Isn't there some kind of limit as to what uh, Michael Huff can do? <laughs> he gets him over the ground. He just rolled him over a time and a half. <laughs> like steer wrestling. <laughs> Michael didn't worth the ball. Give it up. Steve uh, Smith has a knack for making big plays in championship games. He had an incredible game last year against Oklahoma when he caught three touchdown passes. A couple of them were just spectacular. After review. The play stands as ruled on the field. It was a completed catch. Ten nineteen to go in the first half of play. Not a seat of ill. I mean, this has been a hot kick. Forty-two yard line, and Reggie Bush is the beat back. Kirkman is back in there again as the fullback. Line it throws out here to Dwayne Jarrett. 
And the lanky one will go up close to midfield before Aaron Ross can take him down. First catch of the night for Dwayne Jarrett. You see at the end of that play, Aaron Ross doing his best Derek Johnson imitation. The great linebacker who played for the Longhorns last year. Tried to bolo punch that ball out from Jarrett. Amazing how much he's matured in two years. He's just a sophomore. His freshman year, Mum had to come out here and calm him down. He was homesick, wanted to go home. But he stayed the uh, course and he's very happy. I talked to him the other day. Very poised. Young men now. Very comfortable. Bird and Davis are both in the ball game. Tight end. And line of gifts to Bush. Bouncing to the outside. Cut back into traffic. Runs into trouble. He's taken down in a hurry, and uh, it was Michael Huff laying the lick on him. Now it's time for the Aflac trivia question. Who are the three players to win Rose Bowl Player of the Game Award? You know? You know? I know that man has won one time, and I know the quarterback on the other side has won one time. The last two Rose Bowl. Kyle Williams is in uh, at tackle, has been at tackle for USC, and there's your first down down to the 40 yard line for the Trojans. So they're moving the ball again. I would be surprised to see a lot more of Lendell White running the ball right at Texas behind this big offensive line of SC. They're having a lot more success with White pounding the middle. Of this Texas defense than they're having with Bush trying to get wide. We got three tackles. They have three tackles out on the field. Let's see if they're still there. Just so. Bush now seven carries, 31 yards. White five carries, 31 yards, and a touchdown. And it's keeping it. Wanted to go deep. Nobody to throw it to. Now drops it off. And it is complete to Fred Davis. And Davis will get down to about the 32 yard line. Fred Davis was the one who imitated uh, Vince Young as best he could in the practice sessions at quarterback because they're about the same size. And Pete Carroll, the coaches, wanted people to get the perspective of having a man that size working the ball against you on the offense. And uh, Fred did a pretty good job. And Michael Coleman also did a pretty good job as they wanted to get a little more speed and flash than Fred could provide. <laughs> <laughs> Look at this. Boy, he just turned on the jets, didn't he? Brandon Hancock banging away and Lindell White right in his wake, and that's the first down. Why not? Run behind Tiatusi Latui at 365 and Sam Baker at 305. Hancock with another solid block, but that's just a huge hole. And whenever your safety, Michael Huff has to come up and make the tackle, your defense is in trouble right now. You can see Aaron Harris, number two, late getting over there. And now we've got a Texas player. They have problems with cramps. It was actually a fairly warm day today. That's Aaron Harris, the middle linebacker. What did he have a game here last year against Michigan? Huh? 18 tackles in that Whoa. game. Michigan was looking out for Derek Johnson and number two made all the tackles. So they have to repair a chin strap on his hat. Yeah, it's one of those equipment malfunctions that Todd likes to talk about. <laughs> <laughs> That's because he's got a concession down there. You know. <laughs> on the 26 yard line, first down, Southern California on the Texas side of the field. They lead seven to nothing. They're threatening. Orange come up, puts seven in the box, and Reggie Bush bounces outside, and he's ridden out at about the line of scrimmage, maybe a yard on the play. Cedric Griffin refusing to yield on the play. Friday, a groundbreaking new series comes to ABC. Every year, thousands of innocent Americans are wrongly convicted, and where do you turn when the justice system turns on you? Kyle McLaughlin, Jason O'Mara, Injustice Series premiere this Friday. Put it on the 25. Reggie got a yard. Smith is back. We've got Jarrett Turner Smith. Your catcher's on the field right now for SC. Line it back. Let's it go. 
and it's in the corner, and it is intercepted or knocked away by Michael Griffin. He didn't pick it, I guess. Well, he caught it. I don't think he got his feet in 